All right, in this video, we're going to talk about making a copy for each student when you're creating an assignment in Microsoft Teams. So first of all, I'm just going to show how to do it really fast, and then I'm going to show you why you would want to do it. So you just create a new assignment, and you click Add Resources, and then you find the document that you would like to attach. In this case, I'm just going to use this one right here. I click Attach, and I make sure I come over to the three dots, and I change it to Students Edit Their Own Copy. And then each student will get their own copy of this document, and they can start working on it right away. So why would you want to do this? So you could do this as this one was just an example where it's basically just a blank document, and they just start filling it out, but it's already pre-attached, ready to go. Or you could do something a little more advanced where you have a whole digital lesson and you want them to follow your instructions. Maybe you want to give them links or a video or something else, and then they kind of fill in their side of the document. So um, let's look at a couple more reasons as far as um, why you would want to do this. So if you were in the traditional sense of passing out paper, you were, you were just doing that, the student would be working on it or not working on it and the teacher wouldn't know at how far along the student had gotten so you get back a stack of papers when it's due and some of the kids haven't even finished or they have made a mistake or whatever you can't monitor their student progress using paper if you just uh, give them an assignment in teams with the instructions and you don't attach a document they can still click add work and they would get this and they could go find that a document and and upload it or whatever and there could be assignments where you want them to do that that's the task but if you attach it right away then they won't have to search for it or find it and it will be much less likely that they will lose it and then finally um, by attaching the document as soon as they start working on it you can see real-time progress updates and see what they're doing and how they're working and you can interact with them and use the comments so let me show how that all looks so I'm going to use this uh, assignment over here and I'm going to go into a student who has already started working on it and I can see that this student has uh, typed in here and they filled out your, this your answer section they've given an answer for basically box one out of three so they're about like a third of the way done and actually this student is using the comments feature here uh, to ask this teacher a question so I could respond and, and do that and then if the student was in the middle of working on the product um, on the project if they started typing on their vert copy of it I can see their text automatically appear right there and see that they're working and you know basically just monitor their progress you can see in real time you can switch students so I can flip over and use this to switch between different students I can see the student hasn't made any progress you can use the drop down to do that and then of course using the rubrics is a great way um, to be able to grade that quickly and add up the points and all that so basically that's it I definitely recommend make a copy for each student attach the work right away and um, then you can come into the assignment and view uh, what the student is doing as they're doing it Thanks.